Hello and welcome! I'm Mitsu Piano and you're watching Keyblade 3! So we're knocking them down one by one. I'm really hoping none of the remainder will give us as much trouble as Luxor, but I think number one and number 13, the two that unlock after we beat the rest, probably will. <coughs> That said, we won't know till we get there. So, Vanita's got the little void gear, darkness gear, whatever the heck gear this keyblade is called, icon all ready to go. It's gonna be Sora versus Edgy Sora. I've been waiting for this. Hey, hey, you're still too slow. Oh, this is a really nice, like, orchestral remix of his theme song from Birth by Sleep. And we fought this guy so many times in Birth by Sleep, it was ridiculous. So I opted not to use Darkness Resistance for um, this or Terranor, because I remember that like he uses other um, elements, like that big firestorm. Oh, he's still saying too slow! Benitas, you're too slow! And you're not in ultimate form, so who cares? Yeah. Let's go. Oh, okay, Keyblade Surf, I'm guessing, is his limit break. Yeah, definitely. Oh, he's doing he's doing that Shadow Copies move that Benita's Remnant did. I wasn't expecting that. And my brain has automatically gone into spam dodge roll mode, which is not actually the way you avoid stuff in this game. Ow. Um, extra life used. Okay, do I need to, like, break him out of the people I chill? No. I'm kind of surprised it's not unmasked Benitas, but, you know, we fought him in the Keyblade graveyard mask. Oh yeah, by the way, according to a dev interview... Um, these fights represent the canonical power level of the organization in the Keyblade Graveyard. So basically, imagine this is what Sora went through every time, and he still prevailed. I think you'd give me something better than that, Vanitas, but okay. We're getting closer. All we got left between us and the last two is the North Court. Those guys are going to be fun to fight again, but at least we'll be fighting them one at a time. And need a new Koopa coin. And then can we make anything? Well, I think if there was anything we could make, we could already have made it. I do not need 14 AP boost. Why am I even looking at this? No, but we have one AP boost, and we should use it. Even if, like, Sora has no more abilities left to learn. I'd say, oh, I could unequip the the Cosmic Ring and go equip the Flaniversary Badge, but the Flaniversary Badge is on Baymax, which means I'd have to go back to Big Hero 6, which means I'd have to reload the main game file, and I don't want to do that. Especially not when, like, we're already doing so well. 
But yeah.